CSI Celebrity Style Inspiration. Magandang gabi Pilipinas and to everyone watching from all corners of the globe. This is the Manila Times CSI Celebrity Style Inspiration. The Manila Times Entertainment and Lifestyle pages come to life across the Manila Times digital platforms. We're coming to you today from such a lovely poolside in a condominium in Makati City because of our very special guest towards the end of the program in T-Zone. But of course, as usual, we will have a jam-packed episode ready for you with the hottest in showbiz news. Hello and welcome to this episode's edition of T-Zone on CSI. And my guest today is a very distinguished lady and a very talented one, be it on television, the movies, and even the stage. She's been missed for some time, but we will find out if she is coming back to show business very soon and what she's been busy with. Ladies and gentlemen, please join me in catching up with the one and only Desi Tomas. Hello, Miss Desi. Hi, Tessa. Please wow. greet our viewers. What a wonderful introduction. I thought it was a different person. You are you. Yeah, it's, it's, it's always nice to be referred as distinguished, as talented, because as, uh, as stars, sometimes we, we don't remember what we have achieved, you know? Yeah. So anyway, magandang magandang araw po sa inyong lahat. Welcome to my uh, pool, hindi pa. Yes. Ito yung poolside na aking condo, which yes. I'm very proud of. And uh, I think you will know more about me as the interview goes yes, on. But we'll lovely, lovely to be here with all of you today. Yes, that's the reason why Miss Tessie is, uh, well, has that British accent. British accent, It's because yes. she has been spending some time away from the Philippines. Yes. It's been two years since uh, you were last on television and ABS-CBN's yes, yes. blood Sisters. Blood Sisters, yes, yes. And, uh, 2000, uh, 2018, so almost two pa lang. Oh, oh, yes. oh, almost two. And since then, Miss Tessie, please tell our uh, viewers online what you've been busy with. Yes. Um, lately, I've been busy with Test Tube, the Tessie Thomas channel. Oh, okay. And I did that. Uh, pwede ba dito Taglish? Oh, okay oh, lang. Yes, yes, uh, I did that because I wanted to be in touch with my fans uh, globally, mm -hmm. di ba? Kasi ngayon global na. Yes. So, nandun ako sa Isle of Man, tapos nandito kayo, and then I have fans also in America and all over, uh, well, UK, ganyan, in general. So, um, what I did was uh, mount that with my son who flew over uh, from New York to the Isle of Man, and I wrote all the scripts, we brainstormed, but I wrote and wrote, I wrote and just improvised, no? Yung as I talk. Um, Nagumpisa ako sa sa introducing the Isle of Man, and then there was a cute naman. Marami ng vlogs ko mga twelve, because I I persevere yes. to vlog <laughs> to vlog yes. every Thursday, every, every Thursday. Thursday. Yes. yes. So nagsimula yung October, November, December. Tapos nung December nandun kami sa England with uh, the children of Roger na si. Uh, si Alice and Lucy Pullin. So I was vlogging all over London. So you can check it out. It's yes. uh, Test Tube with the Tessie Tomas channel. I yes. love the name Test Tube. Yes. Diba? Very, ko yun, no? very creative. As, yeah, as you, you, you know, you, 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 I, I, I owe advertising because mm -hmm. I was a copywriter okay. and a creative director. No? Yung, 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 yung mga, mga ideas. Uh, very, very memorable ideas, lines, catchphrases. Yes, catchphrases. No? Catch oh. Yes. Talaga, Naaral ko yan sa advertising. Uh, for our millennials lang po, who, who, you know, we would like to introduce you to, because um, yung Blood Sisters nga po yung unang ginawa ni Miss Tessie. Last lately na lang. Oh, lately. But um, of course, Miss Tessie has been known for uh, her, you know, uh, daily morning show before. Yes, Tessie ng Tahana. They were not born yet, ano, yes, mga millennials. And then of course, there's also Abangan ng Susunod na Kabanata, yes. a political satire that was uh, on primetime television where she was the ML Diffic no? yes. of, of the show. Uh, abangan, uh, my name there was Barbara Teng. Barbara. Pero Actually, you know, parang ano din, parang, uh, yeah, genre din ng Meldita. Yes. Because the hair is so big and of course, I suddenly miss him. It's June Incarnation's creation, oh, yung okay. Malalaking Bohok, yes, yes, which yes. was followed, uh, which was copied by other comedians lately. Nakikita Later ko. On. Mm -hmm. oh, 
Pero ang inspiration niya, of course, was the first lady. Na first lady pa rin. Oh, opo, oh. opo. I'm saying that because um, I was told, of course, by our, our good friend and, of course, Miss Desi's manager, si uh, Ricky Gallardo, that, you know, Miss Desi has been such a busy actress, a busy host, and she even comes out in theater and then the live circuit for a very long time. Yes. And, of course, her husband is Kai Roger, the famous Kai Roger. Roger Pullin is our Roger last name. Pullen. Did you have a little deal with him for the to allow you to pursue your career yes. for, for the both of you to live here and then has that sort of uh, yung time frame na binigay niya po sa inyo medyo nag end na po but that's why you're spending more time <laughs> yes. sa England pa paano po yes, na yes. yun and to be very honest um, we are now residents in the Isle of Man so that's something serious no so for me to get into that serious commitment you know my my my, my husband wrote me like a memorandum <laughs> to say these are the advantages yes. of living in the Isle of Man, yes. please consider. So, kasi sa ano siya, eh, sa scientist, uh, Roger is a marine biologist, no? wow. and, it, and British, being British, very proper. Uh -huh. So, uh, he's been persuading me for about five years. Uh -huh. And I said, I'm not ready, ganyan, you know. And then finally, uh, I had to be ready because he said, you know, I'm not getting any younger. Mm -hmm. You may have forgotten it, but, uh, you know, um, we we are uh, she lalo na siya uh -oh. he's now 76 eh okay. so sabi niya, i have very little time left and i have spent 38 years in the philippines okay. with you so kahit saan mo tingnan okay. niyo mathematically okay. talagang konti na yung ora so how could i say no but i just said you know uh, could i just go like every three months to be with my mother yeah. and then Siyempre, sabi ko, <clears throat> maybe I cannot g get a, a, a full teleserie anymore because the teleseries are definitely Haba. six to yeah. eight months, no? So, um, but this time around, siguro parang naawa siya. <laughs> Kasi alam niya, may mga meetings ako sa mga tao-tao, tapos pag tinatanong how long I'll be here, nadi-discourage sila. So finally, he said, darling, you know, if it's really a very important project, Darling, yeah, sabi darling. niya. Darling, yan lang. Ang tawag niya sa akin, uh, ang tawag yes. din naman namin sa isa't isa, darling, okay. or sweetie, ang tawag niya sa akin, or asawa ko. Yan ang mga, di ba? You can only have one asawa. Sana, yes. di ba? Anyway, so pinayagan niya ako this time. For so a this longer is, time. Uh, actually, six months lang ito. Like January to July. Because otherwise, I will be questioned by immigration. You know? but so but I'm hoping things will work out fine yes. and this teleserie will happen soon. Yes, so uh, there is a possibility that you will be in another teleserie for one of the big networks. Yes, no? yes. Opo, opo. Uh, and that's very, that's very right. exciting. My question is, do you miss you miss it, obviously. You miss oh, oh, naman, yes. Opo, of opo. course, of course. I think once an actress, always an actress. But I must say, and I'm not saying uh, I'm just being uh, plastic or what, I actually enjoy my life in the Isle of Man. Uh -huh. Because you can see how beautiful it is, you know. Yes. It has won the UNEP, UNESCO, uh, you know, um, uh, award for being one of the most pristine and one of the most... Uh, uh, the best in nature conservation. So it's so hard to explain. Siguro, you I'll really just, have to see it. Ah, you, you have, have to see it. See it. We are full of, 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 of glens and cliffs and mountains and winding roads and endless greenery and flora and fauna. Talagang parang ako rin, how just go? But how? Every time you come out, you're like in the postcard. Yes, ganun. yes. <laughs> I, I will show you pictures in my... In okay. my um, but uh, just as, taking a step back, well, the first time that you, 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 know, you really did move to the Isle of Man, of course, coming from the Philippines and show business, which is such a busy place, and going to a very pi picturesque and very uh -oh. quiet... Quiet vi village, village life. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. How was the adjustment? Hindi pa masyado kayong na bingi sa quiet <laughs> medyo <laughs> medyo naman medyo medyo nakaka nakaka bore nakaka nakakaiyak ng konte but then ang ganda ng sinabi ng aking uh, counselor friend na si Dr. Rahani Karanda and which became like my tower of strength yes. no uh, i'm a very spiritual person mm -hmm. so i do i do uh, zen meditation oh. which really helps a lot yung buo ka tapos sabi niya ganon you know, the home is within. Parang kinilabutan ako doon na, oh my God, how beautiful na. Every time I'm homesick, I have to look within me and say, okay, okay, ang Pilipinas, nandyan kayo, malayo kayo, pero nandito lang ako, pero buo ako. 
kasi kasama ko naman ang asawa ko. Yes. yes. I think ngayon lang din, I think it's very touching kasi uh, well, I'm not I'm not really uh, bibisihin ko na rin yung yung lifestyle namin ano kasi ang dalas kasi uh, we've been married for 28 25 years but wow. we've been together for 28 mm -hmm. no. In all of those 25 years na married kami, we were both busy. You see lalo na ako. Um Uh, you know, uh, and the last nasa uh, travels din siya as a international marine biologist. I was constantly working, yeah. and when you're working, it's 5 a.m. out of the bed mm -hmm. and back 5 a.m. and in between you vegetate. Oh, yeah. Kaya ang ang ano na lang namin prime time is really no work in between, mm -hmm. di ba? So you're only able to reflect on that lifestyle now when, you, when it's all over. No, that's so, true. so. Uh, masaya din pala na andito, you know, kami dalawa and, and we know that we enjoy each other. As mas, la mas lalo siya na I I think for the longest time ang ranking niya, ang ranking ng priorities ko would be career, mother, Roger. Kasi now, yeah. now it's Roger, di ba? Kasi whether I like it or not. <laughs> I but you know, having spent 38 years of his life here in the Philippines, Ibig sabihin nun, grabe naman ang pagmamahal sa inyo ni Carl Roger. Hindi, Tayo like, nyo naman din. Yes, oo. Oh, oh. <laughs> yung namang 28 lang yung magkasama kami. Opo. But the first 10 years, hindi kami magkakilala. Ah, hindi. You see? Okay, so it took okay. a long time, di ba? Yeah, yes, Pero yes, sabi yes. niya sa akin ganun, I already saw you, uh, you know, like five years ahead, but you were taken. Oh, Kasi may, yes. may boyfriend daw akong yes. iba. Uh -oh. Pero siguro opo, meant kami talaga for each other. Eh, naghintay siya. Oo. Oh, oh. diba? At saka siya pala. Kasi mga tignan ako nag-asawa one time eh. Sa, dun sa isang ano. Colorful ng love life ni Miss Jess. Walang yeah. makakapantay. Oh, oh. Oh. Iba, Very checkered. Oh, dapat yan. Uh, that's another episode all yes. together. Oh. <laughs> you bet. Pero, pero ano po, what is Daisy ng tahanan like in her tahanan in the Isle of Man? In the Isle of Man. Oh. Okay. A typical day for, me, for us is... Uh, We, we, we both wake up 8 a.m. pa, uh, pag walang trabaho. Pag may work siya, uh, hindi naman work, may meeting siya sa labas, mga 7. But you see, what is so stunning, to be honest, is that we live in a Victorian apartment. Wow. Na hinanap niya oh talaga kung ano yung maganda. Yes. And uh, we live in a place called Port St. Mary, wow. which is very picturesque. Yes. And uh, we live across the beach. So every day nakaharap ka sa dagat. So parang ka nasa Boracay oh, every day. Yeah. And then there are seagulls yes, around you. Oh, oh, and uh, we have the the the, the widest variety of ano dun, eh, of mm -hmm. of um, uh, uh, birds, no? Uh, so tapos noon, simple lang yung uh, so, uh, shall I prepare your coffee? Eh, talaga mas British ako doon. So coffee na siya, no? Tapos kanya-kanya kami ng cereal. And then we will talk for an hour. Oh, very you know, nice. Diba? Un like unhurried. Time for each other. Yes. No? And actually, that is that is the time that he has for me. Ah. Kasi after that, pagdating ng 10, nasa computer na yon. he is uh, very involved with the international, he's launching the Iris Sea Center, which is very uh, a very lofty NGO uh, organization that wants to <clears throat> do biodiversity for the entire Iris Sea. At pag sinabi mo yun, involve ang Ireland, ang Wales, at ang Isle of Man. So, it's very big. So, medyo mahirap, no? Tsaka konti pa lang yung tao na nag-volunteer with him. So, glued na siya doon. Tapos doon, sabihin ko, shall we break up for lunch? Ako naman, yung ginagawa ko doon, pag nandun na siya, either, I'm, I'm busy also with my memoir, memoirs. So uh, ginagawa writing. ko sana. Oo, oh, oh. uh -huh. I'm writing. But then now, test tube is also making me busy, so... Titingnan ko na ako anong gagawin ko and also it's I'm also kept busy. After that mag, ang ang lunch namin is only parang sa may sandwich maker lang ako doon. And so it's very uh, either ham and cheese or or tuna or very very simple. Tapos nakaganyan. Tapos magko-coffee siya uli ako hindi mo na magko-coffee. And then we just carry on Siguro from 2 to 5, kung ano't ano man yung either I read or I continue writing. Basta 5, tapos na lahat yan. Mm -hmm. Kailangan, uh, I will cook or he will cook. Okay. So, I, when I cook, gusto niya talaga yung mga pasta dishes. Walang adobo, walang mga ganun. 
niya masyado na. Pag, pag alis ng ano, parang ini-snub na niya. Oo, oh, oh. Hindi siya masyado ngayon nag-hanker dyan. Ah. Nakakakain lang ako ng adobo with my Pinoy friends. friends. Oh, and there are Pinoys in the island. 1,500 so, caregivers and nurses. Oh, oh. Oh. Eh, there, ang saya-saya nila Masa- na nandun si Tacey. Oo oh, oh, naman. Oh. Pero kasi, uh, nakikita ko lang sila pag weekends. Oh, kasi oh. they're all very busy. I must say, my God, do they work hard? May mga double jobs pa sila. Oh, oh. At and what? Lalo na yung mga dalaga pa sila. Sent to the family. Um, Everything. Mm-hmm. No? Uh-huh. It opens but, but they have bungalows. You know, they have their own. They have cars. Their lives. They have, have, oh, they have bungalows. Yeah. So, makita mo naman, ano, they live a good life there. And you know what? Sabi nila din, Naku ma'am, alam ko matahimik dito sa Isle of Man. Pero bakit ganon? Dalawang, dalawang linggo pala ako sa Pilipinas, ingay na ingay na ako. <laughs> Gusto ko lang bumalik sa Isle of Man, sabi ko. Oh. Sabi ko, parang ganun na rin nangyayari sa akin. Oo, oh, nasasanay na rin po nasasanay. kayo, yes. Sabi ko nga, earlier when I was, um, you know, jotting down some questions for you, it's very, very timely to be interviewing you in March because it's Women's Month. Oh, oh and, yes. Uh, you know, you are a woman who has uh, led a successful career. Yes. You have mothered um, a son. And then, uh, you know, you have a strong marriage with, with Ka Roger. Yes. Uh, pa, paano nyo po, si tingin nyo, paano nyo ho lahat yung nagawa? Ngayon nga, you were able to let go of a career that you Uh-oh. so love to spend more time with your husband. How did you get to do it as an advice oh. to women who yes. want to do it all but can't? You know, uh, again, I have to quote Dr. Rahani Karandang you know, because she's my counselor. And she, well, she's been holding my hand kasi sabi ko, parang mahihirapan ako nito. So sabi niya ganun, you always look at the bigger picture. I mean, how has your life been? Uh, oo nga, sabi ko, my God, I've spent 38 years, 40, ako lampas pa, more than 40 years of my life, because I started at the age of 10, ha? Okay. na nag-act sa radio lang. Ah, okay. So, you know, I'm now in my late 60s, so halos 50 years of my life is, has been devoted to, to showbiz. Hindi pa kaya sa patyon, hindi ba that's enough? Na ako rin, it's not only for Roger but for myself to give myself a break, hindi ba? Na parang wow, it, can it be all work, hindi ba? Ano yung saying na life is not work yung ganan, interchanging. Nakalimutan ko tuloy. Basta maganda yun. <laughs> opo, opo. So, uh, parang life is not all work and work doesn't mean life, parang ganyan. So na ano ko yon? Yes, yes. Nadak nadakma ko, na huli yes. ko yon. And uh, I think I have become a more a more relaxed person because of my Zen meditation and just more reflective, mm-hmm. more reflective. And now that we are in our in our the senior years of our life, uh, yung mindfulness malakas okay. na natin ng buhay. Mm-hmm. You know, life is life is short. Don't make it shorter. Mm-hmm. Just slow down. And also, eto then it's a nice break, but uh, it's not there forever. Hindi ba yung acting? So I I will just enjoy it, but. Uh, then I still have to go back to the quiet village life because uh, alam ko malungkot ang asawa ko ngayon. Doon ako nag guilty Oo. We have, he bought, that, uh, he bought that flat for us. It's a two-bedroom Victorian flat na medyo malamig pa ngayon, di ba? So it's, it's kind of sa, uh, to be sad own. also. Oo. Uh-huh. Tsaka doon kasi ang mga tao, they're very home-oriented eh. Hindi naman... Hindi naman laging nasa lansangan. Wala eh. There are only two restaurants, the pubs, and the whatever you have to go to downtown, which is in Cubao. <laughs> oh, ganun kalalayo. Ganun kalalayo. kalalayo. Opo, opo. Kaya naman dito, sa totoo lang, nasa sensory overload ako. Ah, napakaraming, Parang, <sighs> napakarami namang nangyayari. No? It's not only that. The social pressure is so strong. Yes, like now, sure. you know, I'm sure so so many of my friends would say, "On tagal na pala na dito, hindi siya nagpapakita." Mm-hmm. But then, you know, I'm also trying to pace, and my husband was here for a month, ah, okay. so I have to take care of him. Yeah. Kaalis lang niya. Ngayon palang ako na kalakwat siya. Ngayon ka palang kulit dalaga. Ah, po. Yeah. <laughs> only for very, a few. Only for mga very few well said. Months. Yes. Very well yes. said. Dalaga ako ngayon. Oh, but um, in in saying that, at least <clears throat> maganda ho na you have you have the best of both worlds yes. now. You have a career exactly. that you exactly. can always go back to because of the reputation that you've built. Thank you. And then you have a life, a quiet yes. life there yes. that you know you can run to whenever it gets a bit too much here in the Philippines. Pero sa ngayon po, 
Uh, I know that you've said that happy ka naman where you are and you're happy to be here at least uh, three months in a year. Pero what is, is there still something that Miss Desi Tomas would like to do? Uh, yun, yun talagang memoirs, nakakaya pag hindi ko natapos. Oo, oh, in-announce na rin po natin, aabangan ho yan ang marami. Kaya, pero hindi pala, ma, hindi pala madali magsulat ng book. And there's diba? so much to be told. Exactly, sa exactly. Ninyo, no? Yes, yes. Lahat ng And you know, di ba, I'm sure you know it, writing, being a writer requires so much discipline because it's a lonely job, di ba? So, uh, mahirap talaga na to have that discipline. But you see, I'm writing much better now in the Isle of Man because, you know, uh, the writing is in the daily journal that I do. And also, sabi ko, because I, I'm constantly writing, I was able to finish, of course, hindi naman natin masasabi, I, I finished two film scripts. Wow! But kasi pag may idea ako, di ba? Pag nandito ka, may idea ka, ay, teka, Teka muna, may gagawin pa ako. Oh, oh, Teka, may taping ako. Pa, uh -huh. Ano na nga yung idea ko? Mm -hmm. Parang gano'n. Mm -hmm. Pero doon, may idea ako. And then, andyan, andyan lang yung yellow pad ko. Kahit ano yon meaning to say, that's what I want to say. If you're a writer, just write it down. Yeah. And then, it will grow. And you go know? back to it. Yes. You know? And then, But flesh it out later. Find your own Isle of Man. Mahirap naman sa karamihan sa amin nun makahanap ng Isle of Man no, namin. Tama. <laughs> no, no, I feel so lucky, di ba? Yeah. Remember that this is my second marriage, Opo. di ba? And then I got married to a man who's really, uh, kasi disaster, na disaster yung una, di ba? So, uh, you know, it, it's a second lease on life. So, uh, nun dumating yung challenge na aalis na it's just so precious na if I don't, if I didn't go, di ba? If I didn't go, yes. uh, then I think uh, my marriage will be on the rocks. Yes. And now <laughs> it's diba? solid. Yes. Solid as a rock. Solid as a rock. And oh. I think... My husband also knows how much sacrifice it is for me to to give up, you know, what what I have here, career and my family and the lifestyle, yes. di ba? Doon po, napakamahan ng manicure at pedicure. Oh, oh. Kaya puro pedicure na lang, wala ng manicure. <laughs> at saka kami naguhugas ang mga plato, oh. gano'n, nagwawalis dahil wala namang maid, buti na lang. Pero siyang naglalabada. Oh. Kasi inilalagay niya sa washing machine at siyang nagahang oh. ng clothes at siya nagtatapo ng basura. Imagine, di ba, at this, it's at this stage in your life that you're having to do to do all these things, no? Pero nabubuo, mas nabubuo yung pagkatao po ninyo na napagdaanan yes. nyo lahat, no? It's not only that. Ang ganda nung sinabi mo, tama yung napagdaanan ng lahat. And also, it is the gift of discovery yes. because then you meet different sets of people. Iba rin sila. You know, makikita mo si Sandra and Phil, they have two dogs. My God, if you see their house, makita mo yung, kasi sa ganda ng Isle of Man, pagharap mo sa, sa sala nila, ano nakaharap sa'yo? Bulubundukin. Na ang ganda-ganda, tapos may brook pa sila. So it's, I did not appreciate nature until now na pwede palang ganito kaganda. You know, ang ganda-ganda talaga. And then, they are so, they are so natural. Si Sandra nagluluto. Lahat nagluluto eh. You know, baliwala lang sa kanila. Walang maid. Wala talagang maid doon. Yun, ganun. Well, why don't you invite our uh, um, online viewers po sa Manila Times to, to join you in the Isle of Man at least sa Des Chus. Yes, diba? yes, yes. Please invite them there para we will always be updated with Miss Jessie Tomas. Please. Yes, ma. please. Para po dumami pa ang aking mga subscribers sa Test Tube, the Jessie Tomas channel. Please subscribe. Okay? I'm vlogging every week and I've had about 12 to 14 vlogs already. Test Tube, the Jessie Tomas channel. Thank you po. And Thank very you, soon Tessa. we might see her again. We will see her again on one of the big networks on prime time hopefully. yes thank so, you at uh, kung gusto niyo pumunta sa isle of man just take manila to london or manila to manchester and then you take the smaller uh, plane it's only like an hour away by uh, fly b or easy jet when you are in the isle of man it is the diamond shaped island between dublin and liverpool wow talagang ano talagang parang tigaro na tigaro na ko talaga kayo. Ayan, pinopromote ko. <laughs> pinopromote niyo po. Thank you very much, Ms. Thank Stacey, you, it's a pleasure. For, uh, for, you know, welcoming us into your home. Your yes, home. thank you. And uh, we are so happy that you still take the time to come home and at least po makita pa rin kayo ng mga fans. Oo naman, there's no place like home. New generation po na mga manonood natin. Salamat ng marami yes. sa pagkakataong ito. Thank you Tessa. po. And that's it for the T-Zone on CSI. We'll be right back. 
As I always say, time flies when you're having fun and we have reached the end of our program. I'd like to thank the CSI team, of course, Arlo, Christina, Isa, and Nika for all the hard work they've put into this episode. And of course, our director, Shello, our master videographer and editor, Neil, and the dashing gentlemen, the crew of the Manila Times TV. Salamat po sa inyo. Also, thank you very much for uh, my hair and makeup. Of course, my good friend Bambi Fuentes and his salon, and of course, Chris Rain is there. And um, Makeup Reborn, how can I forget Jenny Santa Cruz for prettying up the CSI staff. Hanggang dito na lang po, and we'll see you again next week. Bye!